forever a champion. How about that? Absolute madness. It's almost game time here at the Gallagher Iba Arena in Stillwater, Oklahoma. What a game we have in store for us today. The Boise State Broncos face off against the Oklahoma State Cowboys. Hello there. Along with Bill Raftery, I'm Vern Lundquist. Bonnie Bernstein is with us as well. The Oklahoma State head coach has his guys prepared for the matchup today. Your thoughts, Bill? Coach Sutton preaches one thing, Vern. Defense, defense, defense. His players can lock you down defensively because that's the priority number one at the beginning of practice. He's just one tough coach to play against. The Boise State head coach leads his team into the fray today. What's your take, Bill? Coach Graham has been concentrating on developing his team's defensive skills, Vern. He believes the key to winning games is stopping the other guys, and that's a very tough argument to fight against. Eppenheimer should be a central part of the game plan today. Eppenheimer is an exceptional shooting guard. This guy has such a will to win. He plays the game with joy, and he never stops working to improve. Rand should be a main contributor on the other side. Rand is a tremendous shooting guard as well. He's such a hard worker out there, and he can do a little bit of everything. A great competitor, no question. All right, thanks, Bill. We're just about ready to get this one started. The Cowboys control the tip-off, and we'll get this one started. Backs down. Edens reels in the offensive rebound. Lays it right in. from 18 feet away. It drops. What a pass. That's good team basketball, Vern. The Cowboys bring it up. About nine and a half minutes left in the half. Tries to post him up. Goes up, banks it right in. The lay-in with the soft kiss. Boise State takes it up court. They're trailing four to two. Pass, top of the key. Pass, left side. Beyond the arc. Barry snatches it down. The break is on. Salisbury backs him down. The post shot was no good by Salisbury. Tough one there. They've got a good look and they couldn't capitalize. Stapleton dumps it down low. Slam down by Holloway. Oklahoma State brings it up. About eight and a half minutes left in the half. Eppenheimer tries to back down. Dumps it off. Tosses it up. Holloway corrals the miss. Boise State brings it up. We've got a tie ball game here. The layup was finished by Stapleton. They're playing a 2-3 zone with minimum principles. Eppenheimer passes it to the top of the key. The steal by Holloway. Capped off with a dunk by Sato. The best way to make sure these dunks are going to go down and stay down is to be strong with both hands. Backs in. With the drop step. 
Nope. Let's check in with our sideline reporter, Bonnie Bernstein, who has some information for us. Thanks, Vern. Before the game, it caught up with Coach Sutton of the Cowboys. The offensive game plan? Well, Coach said, we want to push the break, try to create some easy shot opportunities. Speed, of course, is a great weapon for this team. It sounds like Coach plans to use it. So, guys, I don't know. We could be seeing a track meet today. Thank you, Bonnie. The Cowboys bring it up. They trail by four. Gives the up fake. Eppenheimer dishes inside. Stapleton intercepted the pass. That's how it's done, Vern. Wait for the ball to be exposed and then poke it loose. Medina skips it to the baseline. The shot was missed by Rand. Holloway has picked up his first foul of the game. The Cowboys will bring in some players from off the bench. The Cowboys take it up court. About six and a half minutes left in the half. Pass, top of the key. The triple was off the mark by Odig Bela. Edens got fouled hard there, and he'll get two free throws. And he makes the first. And he splits the free throws. The powerful dunk was hammered down by Odig Bela. The Broncos bring it up. They're in front by one. Rand passes to the top of the key. Stapleton swings it to the right side. Rand was fouled from beyond the arc. He'll get three foul shots. Can't sink the first. He sinks the second. Reeled in by Minifield. The Cowboys take it up court. They can tie it with the basket here. The game is tied after that bucket by Odig Bela. Getting in tight, just a great entry feed. Humphrey passes it to the right side. Count that last J by Sato. The Cowboys bring it up. They're four for nine from the field. Papula gives the up fake. Far side. For the lead. Gets it to go. The Broncos take it up court. And it's a one-point game. Launches one from beyond the arc. Nails it. Tremendous answer. Give up a three, then get it right back. Oklahoma State takes it up court. Under five minutes left in the half. Tries to back him in. Eppenheimer dumps it to the middle. What a pretty assist on the play by Eppenheimer. The Cowboys are making a group substitution. The Broncos will make some substitutions. They've gone to a man man burn. Holloway passes to the right block. Book that post shot by Rand. Great delivery with the skip pass. That set up the shot perfectly. Oklahoma State brings it up. They're shooting 54% from the field. 
Puts up the tray. Holloway gets the rebound. The Broncos take it up court. They're leading 16 to 14. Takes a three. Off the back of the cylinder and out. The Cowboys bring it up under four minutes left in the half. So passes it to the right wing. For the lead, gets the second chance basket to go. Rand backs in. Rebounded inside by Medina. Tried to lay it right in, but no good by Medina. Look at him fight for the board. That's how it's done, Vern. To take the lead. Ruffin grabs the rebound inside. Boise State takes it up court. We've got a tie ball game here. Holloway tries to post him up. Fires from the wing. Barry grabs it, and that's his third rebound of the contest. Passes cross court. For the lead. Puts too much on it. Boise State takes it up court. 2.41 left in the first half. To take the lead. Tickles the twine. Oklahoma State will take its first timeout. The Broncos will make some substitutions. The Cowboys bring it up. They're 7 for 16 from the floor. Dumps it off. Salisbury passes it to the outside. Salisbury feeds it down low. The Cowboys were the last ones to touch it, and they'll turn it over. Boise State brings it up, and it's a two-point game. Backs down with the hook shot. Jennings hauls it down inside. You want to talk about physicality? This big fella clearing him out. Everybody out of the way. Pass right wing. Shoots the turnaround off the front rim and out. With the crossover. With the runner, Joseph hauls it in. The Cowboys take it up court. They're shooting 38% from the field. Salisbury swings it to the top of the key. Snatched inside by Medina. Boise State brings it up. 120 left in the first half. Jammed by Joseph. The Broncos take it up court. It's all tied. Medina passes to the baseline. Snatched down inside by Barry. They'll try to retake the lead. Pass baseline for the lead. Count it. The Broncos will take a timeout. The Broncos will go with a different look out there. Boise State takes it up court. 38 seconds left in the first half. Dumps it off. Banjo passes it to the high post. The tough shot gets the bucket. That's one of those shots that has a coach saying, no, no, yes. 
Papula swings it to the left side. The buzzer beater off the mark. We've reached halftime with the score 20 to 20. Now that we've reached the halfway point, Bill, what do you think about the goings on in the first half? Right now, you'd have to say it's anybody's game at this point. The first few moments of the second half could be very important. The Cowboys have got it tied up here on their home court. Edens has been hitting his shots at a real high percentage. They need to get him the ball in the second half and try to use his hot hand to their advantage. Thanks, Bill. We're all set to begin the second half. You're living in this tiny booth, but your team's tied at the half with a mid-major school, and you don't want to miss a thing. With DirecTV from AT&T, you can stream all your live NCAA March Madness games on your devices. I forgot to get this. Get DirecTV for $25 a month when you have the new AT&T Unlimited Plus plan. Introducing Nintendo Score 64 and win at Taco Bell. Just peel the coin off the lid, Score 64, and you could win an N64 system, cash, or millions of other great prizes. And who knows who'll win the Porsche Boxster. It scores 64 and win only at Taco Bell. During NCAA March Madness, fans of all 68 schools came together. And as their teams went down the road to Final Four, they took a step from rivalry to friendship. Final Forgers board. The final what is who? On color commentary, it's me, Charles Broccoli. <laughs> and we got the legendary Jim Nass on the log. Healthy and delicious. And what Final Four is complete <laughs> without my two buddies, Ham Jackson and Spike Bree? Yo, yo. And it's snowing in many snackless. Blizzard like conditions at the Final Four. <laughs> <laughs> that voice. Amazing. The CBS Sports Desk is presented by the new AT&T. Hello, everybody. I'm Tim Brando. Welcome to the AT&T CBS Sports Desk. Today in college football, some incredible games in the Pac-10. Oregon goes up 21-3 behind Dennis Dixon to Jason Williams. They're now up by 8-21-13. Over in the Big 12, Kansas improved to 9-0 for the first time in 99 years, routing Nebraska, hanging 76 on them. Navy stuffs a potential tying two-point conversion for Notre Dame, thus snapping an NCAA record 43-game losing streak to the Irish. Ohio State moves to 10-0. Number two, B.C. in the BCS standings, just underway at home with Florida State. Missouri needs a win to keep pace with Kansas. Texas comes from 21 down to beat Oklahoma State. And some sad news to report. World-class distance runner Ryan Shea died today during the U.S. Men's Olympic Marathon Trials in New York City. The 28-year-old former U.S. champion collapsed five and a half miles into the race. That's all for now from the AT&T CBS Sports Desk. Let's get you back to LSU, Alabama. The CBS Sports Desk is presented by the new AT&T. I love the defense. Man to man, Vern. Banjo inbounds the ball, and the second half is underway. Bonnie Bernstein has more as to what went on at halftime. Bonnie? Thanks, Vern. At the break, I talk with Coach Sutton of the Cowboys, and he feels pretty strongly his team has yet to play its best ball today. And basically, shot selection was his biggest bone of contention. He said, I want my guys to dribble, penetrate, work the ball inside more. Don't be so quick to settle for the outside shot. Thanks, Bonnie. Shoots the three. Salzburg has it. And that's his third rebound of the contest. Boise State brings it up. They're 9 for 19 for the game. Pass, top of the key, to take the lead. Hits right rim and doesn't fall. 
The Cowboys bring it up. Just over nine minutes left in the second half. Misfired by Edens. The Broncos bring it up. We've got a tie ball game here. Banjo swings it to the left side. Banjo passes it to the right block. A ferocious swat to send that shot away. Dumps it off. Baseline for the lead. Yes! The Broncos take it up court. They've got to find a way to score. Holloway passes to the left block. Takes it in. Banjo corrals the miss inside. Way to stay active on the offensive glass. Great rebound. Stapleton passes to the top of the key. Couldn't take the lead there. Missed by Banjo. Papula passes it to the right block. Hauled in by Holloway. That's his fourth rebound thus far. Sato passes to the left side. Rand passes it to the baseline. Grabbed by Barry. The Cowboys take it up court. About seven and a half minutes left in the second half. Can't get the jumper to fall. Banjo brings it up. He's zero for three from long range. Pass left side. Rand passes it to the corner. From about 19 feet, Edens snatches the rebound. Salisbury dishes it to the middle. Boise State calls time. Medina got a quick breather, but they need him back on the floor. Facing a narrow deficit. Skip pass. Baseline. Puts it up. Can't connect on the short range jumper. He was working hard for that shot, but the defender worked just a little bit harder. Minifield passes back to the baseline. 12 footer was off by Eppenheimer. Boise State takes it up court. About six and a half minutes left in the second half. Banjo skips it to the left side. To stop the drought. It falls short. The Cowboys take it up court. They're shooting 33% for the game. Robbed by Rand. Oduk Bela was right there and stuffed that shot. He read that shot so beautifully. He knew exactly when to go up and get that one. Wonderful execution. Tries to back down. Shoots from the post. Medina collected inside. The Broncos bring it up. They're behind 24 to 20. Rand passes to the left block. The inside shot was buried by Medina. The Cowboys take it up court. About five and a half minutes left in the second half. Papula skips it to the baseline. Rand picked off that pass for his second steal of the contest. The shot for the tie was off the mark by Rand. Eppenheimer brings it up the floor. He's shooting 22% from the floor. Ball, ball, ball. 
Eppenheimer backs him down. Spins to the middle. Flips it in for two. Boise State calls timeout. The Broncos are making substitutions. The Broncos bring it up. They're down by four. Four, three. Barry grabs it, and that's his eighth rebound of the contest. Pass, far side. Skip pass, top of the key. Eppenheimer crosses it over. Rand ties him up, but the possession arrow pointing to the offense, and they'll keep the ball. To the rim. Hits the layup. Great finish. That's how you want your guys to do it. Take it strong to the rack. Boise State takes it up court. They're one for nine from downtown. Pump fakes. For three, sinks it. Oklahoma State brings it up. They're ahead by three. Barry passes to the right block. From the left block, it's off. Eppenheimer has picked up his first foul of the game. The Broncos bring it up. They can tie it with a three. Pass, top of the key to tie it up. Salisbury grabs the rock. Cross court. Connects from 10 feet out. Boise State calls time. They've got one left. Sato is back in the game after a short rest. The Broncos take it up court. 258 left in the game. Medina swings it to the top of the key. The shot was missed long by Ruffin. The Cowboys bring it up. They're up. 30 to 25. From 18 feet away, cans the shot. Tough shot. He can stroke it when he gets it going a little bit. Sato brings it up court. He's four for five from the floor. Holloway tries to post him up. Puts it up on the run, but it won't fall by Holloway. Eppenheimer spins. Offensive rebound grabbed by Barry. Slam down by Barry. Boise State brings it up. 2.03 left in the game. The quick shot. No luck. That was a tough shot. You've got to try to find a better look than that. Boise State takes it up court, and it's a nine-point game. Ruffin passes it to the right corner. Misfire on the three by Rand. The Cowboys take it up court. Basket here would give them a double-digit lead. Salisbury passes to the top of the key. Sato stripped it away. Capped off with a dunk by Sato. Where was the D? There's an example of poor defense making a guy look good. They're running. Papula skips it to the right side. Eppenheimer feeds it to the middle. No good on the jumper by Salisbury. With the crossover, with the floater, Medina snatches the rebound. 
can't finish at the rim. They can go two for one here, Vern, if they're alert enough. He's doubled up. The quick shot was hit by Edmonds. Nice job getting the ball in tight and finishing. The loose D helped too. Boise State brings it up. 42 seconds left in the game. The tough shot. Edmonds grabs the rock. It's picked off by Ruffin. Finished up with a dunk by Holloway. The best way to make sure these dunks are going to go down and stay down is to be strong with both hands. The Cowboys take it up court. Looks like they have this one wrapped up. That'll do it. Oklahoma State defeats the Broncos 36 to 29. It was an interesting contest. Let's go to Greg Gumbel back in the studio for the Pontiac game-changing performance. Thank you, Vern, and welcome everyone to the 2K Sports Studios. I'm Greg Gumbel with today's Pontiac game-changing performance. Nothing intimidates an opponent like a monster dunk. The Cowboy made spectacular plays like this one the norm in their runaway victory. How impressive is that? That's your Pontiac game-changing performance. On behalf of Pontiac and all of us here in the studio, I'm Greg Gumbel. Now, let's go back courtside and Vern Lundquist. Okay, thanks, Greg. Well, that'll do it from here. This is Vern Lundquist for Bonnie Bernstein and Bill Raftery saying thanks for joining us for NCAA Basketball on 2K Sports. Uh -huh.